Welcome back, Brick Maniacs. I'm at the designer desk of Cody Cell, but we're talking about a Sam Krakauer kit, uh, the <laughs> two centimeter flak Veerling 38 anti-aircraft weapon. That's the one. Cool. Ooh. So this is uh, this has got a real sweet look to it. You can just tell uh, just by looking at it that this thing packed quite a punch. Oh yeah. Um, what can you tell me about this? Um, so it's a uh, it's a flak 38 uh, quad mount. Okay. So it's it's four flak 38s. Uh, combined into one, mm -hmm. so it's it's a really cool an aircraft gun. It fires uh, at a very high rate. Okay. Um, but a lot of times, just on its own, they would use it for even anti-tank um, and an artillery piece, just just the single cannon as well. Okay. So, and they mounted it on a lot of different vehicles as well. I think so, um, on top of some Panzers. Um, kind of had a cool weird turret sure. around it. It's it's a, a, of a similar shape mm -hmm. um, to. To this mount here, just on top of a tank. Okay. Um, very versatile, versatile gun. Mm -hmm. um, Shot awful fast too, if I recall. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Yep. So, packed a punch. Um, cool. It's got a really cool color scheme here um, that Sam built. So, not my kit. Sam Krakauer built this, mm -hmm. um, designed it. Uh, he was I'm here. not landing either. If you haven't noticed. <laughs> <laughs> Sam was here for the summer. Uh, design intern did a fantastic job. He made some really cool kits. I'm yeah. sure some of you have bought some of his stuff in the past, and uh, here's another one to add to his collection. Yeah, and, and I noticed right away too. The, you kind of talked about the the interesting shape of it too. He's got he's got really good angling there for such a small kit to like yeah. uh, compact that down. Yeah, he, uh, he packed in a, a ton of detail in here. Um, he's got a couple chairs on the sides mm -hmm. and on the back. And he even has our printed gun sight. I think that was yeah. one of our first ever printed elements in house. Was it bullseye sight? I think so. Very cool. So we're, we're reusing it. Maybe not. It, it was close to being the first, sure. if, if it wasn't the first. Well, it adds a lot to this kit, just kind of that next layer of detail, too, to, to have something like that included. Right. So, and then uh, like this, this swivels as well, and also yep. the uh, swivels gun full, elevate and depress. Full 360, it goes up to 90. Mm -hmm. You can probably even get it to go past 90. Um, if you if you try really hard, <laughs> no, I, I'm sure it's pretty easy cool. to get it to go up that high. Um, yeah, nice, simple, fun kit. Uh, I think it pairs well with the Henkel. Yeah, um, sure. HG 111, of course, it wouldn't be shooting its own <laughs> mm -hmm. plane, but um, they kind of coincide a little bit. Yeah, very very cool. Well, it's a it's a you know obviously a smaller kit, but at the same time, it's got a lot of functionality and a lot of detail to it. So, uh, well done, Sam. Yeah, he, he did a great job. It's, and it was a ton of fun. It's a ton of fun to play with. Yeah, very cool. All right, so that is the two centimeter Flak Veerling 38 anti aircraft gun, quad mounted uh, anti aircraft gun. Uh, it looks uh, just as cool as it functions. So uh, <laughs> make sure to check that out on BrickMedia.com this week. Uh, otherwise, like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching.